I will have the penne alla arrabbiata. That's Jeff Vader, that is. This one is wet. This one is wet. This one is wet. Did you dry this in rainforest? Why? <laughs> With the power of the Death Star, can we not have a tray that is fucking dry? My bedroom is a disaster. Hi, Lily. <laughs> Uh, my name is Angie McMahon and I'm a songwriter, singer, songwriter, performer, I think. <laughs> I'm trying to be. <laughs> the reason behind it for me is self-expression in the form of relating to other people and connecting with other people. The songwriting feels best when it's really honest, concise expression of my own experiences, but then understanding that other people hear it and relate to it and it's like a, a shared human experience. And then the performing is like connecting with people in a physical way, like with the eye contact and the, the emotions and like in like a way that I can't do in life normally with talking or walking down the street it's like I love doing it and it brings me so much joy just to sing but also to connect with people is I think the thing that brings value I remember being quite young I, I remember the feeling of wanting to dedicate a lot of time to it I don't really remember when I started thinking about it as a career but I remember being quite young and listening to records and playing piano and, and expressing myself and singing and like the idea of using my voice as an instrument, the expression, like the feeling of that expression was more interesting to me than anything else that was going on. Yeah, I remember asking my dad, I was like feeling really sad about like making a record because I was like, I'm spending so much time doing this and I'm thinking about myself as a singer all the time and like, doesn't that seem like a selfish job, dad, please tell me. <laughs> and he was, he said the same thing. He was like, no, think of all the artists that you love and the way that they have influenced society and they've influenced you like it does. It is an important job, like art is really important, especially when the world is so like fucking messed up. Art is one of the most powerful things I think. So. It's like, it feels like an honorable job. I find it hard to motivate myself to be creative sometimes. And one of the things I'm trying to learn is to like, to push through and create anyway. Something that I think is really important with creating, it's like, it's so important to make bad shit. Like, it's so important. And I have heard other people say it, and I always agree with it. It's like, you have to put aside that standard that you have set for yourself, which is like, you're not gonna make that straight away. You're gonna necessarily gonna be able to get there straight away. You have to be open to being shit. And that is hard because there's like ego involved and there's people watching. And, but yeah, I think that, that maybe that's one of the things that holds people back from being creative. So much of the time, it would just be like, oh, well, it's not going to be good, like whatever I make. I'm going to sit down and draw a picture and it's going to be shit, so what's the point of doing it? Because I'm just going to hate it and I'm going to hate myself. It's like, yeah, maybe, but if you can move past that and do it every single day, then you're, you're giving yourself this opportunity to create and develop and actually reach the standard that you want to reach. And that's, it's really hard. Like, it's hard to see yourself as not being good. I think it's actually also like the most important thing. Make more stuff. Make more stuff. Yeah. That's good for you to make stuff. How am I simultaneously on top of someone's pedestal and also under? It's been like the busiest year of my life, the two years. I don't know the times, the time spent. Since like releasing music and like doing the job that I always wanted to do, it's been like so busy. And I'm always thinking about how to be happy while it's happening because there's like these milestones that I'm reaching that I always thought were going to make me happy. Whether it's like playing in front of a certain amount of people, um, releasing a song that does really well. And it's not the material things, 
It's not those milestones that actually make you happy. It's like the human interactions, the smaller moments. So I think the things that I'm learning that are like the most important that I understand in this wise 25 year old <laughs> is like positivity and really trying to be open-minded to positive thinking and being brave enough to create, blocking out the pressures and following your gut. Those are the things that I've like been some of the most important. <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>